it's your boy Kratos, bringing it to you live on the Crates train. It is January 30th, and I'm bringing Kingdom Hearts to you ready and live. So it's been a day past since the game's come out. So at this point, I can't promise that I'm not going to be spoilers. This image right here is a spoiler. If you come to this page, it is a spoiler. You know, I hope at this point you've got to this part, and I'm not going to talk about that part. What I'm here for is to talk about that global release and my standpoint on it. You know, we've got a point where it's to the point that it's finally. I can say without a shadow of a doubt, spoilers are short and sure from what I'm about to say and show you. So I'm going to keep it right here. We're going to keep all Sora being being as beautiful as he can be right over here. And uh, I want to make this video to make a point. 13 years and a baby is a teenager. 13 years and companies could grow into huge conglomerates. 13 years. About 13 years, I think Square and Enix had become well, what it is today. That's a good point. And 13 years ago, we were all much younger. Some of us weren't even alive. But I'm telling you from a person who's on the side who's played Kingdom Hearts since the day it released in America. Uh, what I want to mean to say is, for me, I had a lot to, I'm coming into this game expecting a lot. Expecting and seeing and hoping and wishing that all this side story content from about 13 years of non-sequential games that I was forced to play through that I'm going to get what I want finally. That's what Kratos is hoping for. And, and so this video is for that person. Kingdom Hearts, I would say personally, is for the faint of heart. I mean, if you have no idea what the heck any of this is, at least you know without a doubt that you know Disney. You've seen Disney your whole life. And if you haven't, eh, that will be a good place to start. Anyway, anyway, none of that matters. Or maybe it does. This video is for the person who has played the series up to this point. And for the people who have no idea what this game is. Kratos is here to say something to both of you and everyone in between. So if you're asking if this is worth your time, the answer is... Why ask if a child is born if it's alive? It's already here. Or why does the sun rise? It's already coming. So this is a natural, elongated time period that has finally come to pass that is something that we had to wait for forever. And some of you people have no idea where, where we're coming from from this. You know, we're, I'm an avid Kingdom Hearts fan. I mean, I know a lot about Kingdom Hearts. 13 years worth and even longer. You know, but I like to say that we're 13. Cause just because Organization 13. And I, I got a nerd about that. You know. For me, this might be the start of a series that might be much longer than just 80 hours of gameplay. This could be 3,000 hours of gameplay. Who really knows? I kind of know. I have an idea. And I'm going to be I'm going to be working on this. And this is just the beginning. Definitely if you're on the fence about getting Kingdom Hearts and you have seen a bunch of other YouTube videos, add mine to the list. Cuz Kratos is going to keep giving this to you live and hopefully Keep it moving strong. It's Kratos signing off for the first time on Kingdom Hearts 3. I'm out.